Hey, Wendy. So I just have a couple of questions for you regarding your experience here at Port City Chiropractic. So had you ever been to another chiropractor prior to your treatment here? Yes, I had. Um, I've been, um, I'm going to be 71 and I have been in chiropractic care with different chiropractors since I was about 29 years old. Oh, wow. How would you say your experience has differed between other chiropractors and then your treatment here? Um, the, I like the way that Dr. Shapiro, you, you explain to him that it's your knee, your hip, your back, whatever, and he embraces it and understands it instantly. Yeah. And you don't feel like he's on a fact finding mission. You feel like he really understands what's going on. And yeah. that's been the difference for me. I don't want to feel like, um, I know we're all individuals, but I don't want to feel like I'm on a fact finding mission with yeah. the doctor who has gone to school to be educated for this. Right. And Dr. Shapiro is so far away from that, which I am so grateful for. Yeah. And the story. The nice thing about the whole process is like, he's taken images. He kind of knows like your body and the areas that, that have issues and that might go wrong. So all he really has to do is look at you and from years of experience, just see the way you walk and go, there's the problem. And so that makes it a lot easier for him to just pinpoint what's going on. So when exactly. he's in my knee, it's like he already understands your case and therefore it's a lot easier. So yeah, I totally feel you there. Um, and so then how has your treatment here helped you in your day-to-day -day life and your pain and all of that? Uh, it's been fantastic. It, it is very much a part of, um, you know, I drink water every day and I yeah. would not think of living my life without having chiropractic care. I just yeah. wouldn't. It's a part of your routine. And then have you referred other people here? And if not, what would you say to somebody that's close to you if they ask whether or not they should be going to a chiropractor? I, I have referred other people. Yeah. And um, whether or not they have taken, taken up the, the challenge to go. Um, a lot of my friends are, uh, they, some of them just don't understand. And yeah. so you have to explain to them. Um, and then they, they want to go, they'll say, well, I'll go to an orthopedic and I go, okay. I said, um, the thing I like about Dr. Shapiro is the hip problem you're complaining about um, could be fixed probably in two visits. Right. Yeah. It doesn't Versus, take like, a whole ton of time for him to figure it out, which is nice. Sometimes there's a treatment plan attached to that, depending on the yes. case, but there's definitely like a plan that he can put in place. And if not, he right. has no problem referring out, you know what I mean? If it's something that he feels he can't help you with, which is... I haven't come across somebody that he can't help. So, right, right, and you know, people throw um, meds at at pain, and yeah. I don't think that solves the problem. Myself, I think yeah. there, you know, th there's something structurally wrong sometimes that right. gets fixed, and then you're good. It covers so. the symptom instead of getting down to the root cause. If we can get down to the root cause, then we won't need the med to cover the symptom. It's kind of like exactly. A let's trace this back to where it actually started. Um, and then what would you tell somebody who has never been to a chiropractor before who's on the fence about coming in? What would you tell them about chiropractic care? Um, I would tell them that it is, um, boy, that's interesting. I would tell them that it's, it works and it, and you never realize how out of alignment your body is yeah. until you get into doing chiropractic care. And then you're so aware of your body, which is wonderful because you know yeah. when things have gone wrong. Right. Something he always says is a fish never knows how wet it is. So like people don't really realize how much pain they're in until they're not in pain anymore. So it's one of those things. And you get adjusted and you realize that, wow, it's like you're actually not supposed to be in pain. And it kind of keeps that yes. treatment plan yes. to realize what it's doing. 
Well, thank you so much for hopping on and having a little interview with me. We definitely appreciate you. You're a great part of our practice here. We have your art on our walls for all to see. Well, thank you. Beautify our practice as well. So we really appreciate you. Well, thank you so much and have a great day, Sarah. And, and, and time. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Wendy. Bye-bye. <laughs>